My name's Roy Sandbach. I worked for many years at Procter & Gamble, um, subsequently at Newcastle University. I have had an apprenticeship. It's, it's called my professional life. Um, I worked for a major multinational in chemistry. I've worked in HE. Um, I still uh, work in HE as the chair of the Northern Accelerator, which is the research and commercialization efforts of Newcastle, Durham, Sunderland, and Northumbria University. Um, and I've worked in the public arena. Beyond that, um, I'm a chemistry enthusiast. Um, I remember my chemistry set with slaked lime and tartaric acid. And I still am interested in the emerging technologies that are coming out of the um, uh, program that the RSC runs with very small businesses and um, university researchers. I get, I get the feeling of pride every time I go to Berlin House. This is my profession. It's my place. Um, I've had the opportunity to take my 90-year-old mother and my five-year-old grandson to Burlington House. And the overwhelming sense of pride in a profession um, is exhibited perfectly in that place. Um, why wouldn't I want to contribute even more to the work that I do there? Uh, we're in a situation right now which is one of change. And by 2022, we'll probably still be recognizing the impact of some of these unbelievable global uh, changes that are upon us now. Um, I think the, there are several principles at stake here though. I think first of all, the RSC at that time will need to continue to be, and I'm sure we'll continue to work on this in the meantime, will continue to need to be relevant. The RSC will need to be meaningful and will need to be seen to work on meaningful issues, probably issues that affect and are considered by uh, the global population. Um, I think people will become more aware that we have major global challenges that chemistry can play a part in, and the RSC needs to be at the center of that conversation. Um, chemistry will um, need to maintain a sense of uniqueness and a sense of unique contribution um, as, we, as, as we go forward. Um, I think we all, as chemists, need to continue to feel as if we, that we, we make that unique contribution. We need to maintain that uniqueness and yet work in a, in a, a, a big team spirit in the context of providing scientific solutions. Um, the RSC can contribute to this in a, in, a, in a fantastic way. I mean, the RSC is our accrediting body. It provides a professional um, hub, if you like, um, for chemists, uh, in, in chemistry. Uh, in addition, it has so many connections, so many networks into broad um, science and scientific solutions and policy that uh, it's perfectly placed to ensure that we remain unique, but equally we provide solutions which are based on interdisciplinary activities.